Hello, how are you on this beautiful day? This reading is for those of, this is a love reading, okay? For the collective people in the group, so this might be for you, and then it might not be for you. Yes, but let's get right into this, okay? Somebody was going through some problems when it came down to their life, even when it came down to love. It's like you wasn't living in the moment. Okay, and it got to the point to where you just started allowing things to pass you by. Okay, and it was like you wasn't even at that place in your life to where you would be like completely happy at all. Okay, um, and it's to the point to where you just really lost hope, you lost faith as well because you was not getting. The, fulfill the fulfillment that you wanted, okay, out of your life, all right, um, yeah, so you wasn't living in the here and now, you wasn't getting the things that you wanted, you wasn't satisfied at all, you wasn't really happy, also, when it came down to things that was going on with you as well, okay, um, it's to the point to where you just lost all your strength, like you really couldn't deal with some of the, the, the things that you were going through, not being able to live in the moment not being able to be happy and to be satisfied as well and it's like you weren't even at that place of being happy or to having more so it was like you was really going through a lack you was going through some trying times as well okay and it's to the point to where you just kept reliving the past instead of just stepping out and just start enjoying the future, the new person, the new beginning in your life, you just wasn't. You just kept dwelling on the past, dwelling on the past, focusing on the past. Therefore, you were not getting that happiness, that fulfillment, that love, that joy, that peace, that satisfaction that you was looking for because you were still living and still playing in the past, you know, and it's like you lost all your strength, but it's your fault, right? It's like you weren't even, it's like you weren't even at that place or near the place of getting everything. Like, oh my gosh, I'm just so excited. It's like you weren't even at that place, at that doorway at all either. You know, you were not. Now it's, now it's time for you to what? You have to start finding yourself. You got to start having inner peace within as well you got to start letting things go you have to start forgiving yourself as well because it's like it's your fault you was living in the past so now it's like now it's time for me to start getting in touch with myself start learning and knowing who i am also okay you got to start staying focused and paying attention to your intuition as well all right and you got to continue to stay positive what is it that you really want what is it that you really want? It's like you really got to question yourself when it comes down to that also. What do you want? Set forth positive into intentions. What good do you have? What good is it that you want? Because you got to set that intention. You got to set it. You got to focus on it. And you got to stop making the plan. You got to stop making things right when it comes down to that. Okay, like you will be happy once you start coming up with a plan. Okay, come up with a plan, and it's like you're right there at the place of getting all of your blessings. All you got to do is stop living in the past and start living in the present, start letting go of things that had not hurt you as well, and start living in the now. Living in the now, so start coming up with some. You got to just start thinking positive and start moving positive. Okay, when it comes down to this, because you the one. That was holding yourself back when it came down to love. That was nobody but you. You the reason why you weren't getting what you wanted. You the reason why you wasn't all the way happy. <laughs> all the way happy. You the reason why. Okay? You the reason why you're not happy right now. So, you want to be in a relationship. You want to be loved. You got to start living in a now. You got to start letting go of the past. The past is the past. Okay? You wasn't happy when you was back there in the past. Now it's at the point now to where you have to stop making up your mind. Make your mind up and stop making excuses. Do you really want to be happy? Do you really want to be in a relationship? Because if you do, it's time for you to start setting for positive intentions and start making things happen as well so that you can be happy. Boom. Period. 
okay? And you got to start knowing that because when you start doing that, you're going to get everything that your heart desires. Like you are going to be having a new beginning, a new chapter in your life as well. A new chapter. You're getting ready to start. But you have to start learning from that situation. Like learn from the past. Learn from your past mistakes. Learn about it. Learn from it. Yeah. Learn from it. Okay? And it's like now you're getting all kind of insight now. Because now you understand, I need to be thinking positive. I need to set forth positive in, um, intentions as well. Maybe if I do something kind, maybe if I be nice, maybe this person will start looking at me in a whole totally different way. Okay? And that's what you got to start doing because it's your fault. You're still living in the past. So you just got to start forgiving the person that hurt you. Not only forgive the person that hurt you, but you got to start forgiving yourself. Okay? Um, because it's like a lack. It was a lack of communication in the past. And now it's to the point to where you are lacking. You're lacking love. Okay? And it's like you want love. You want a relationship. But you still not, you know, letting go of the past. Let it go. And live it now. Forgive that person that hurt you. Not only forgive that person, but you got to start forgiving yourself. Start caring about you and start doing more for you as well. You got to. You got to. This is all about love. Don't you want love? Yeah. So, you know, there was some things that was going on with you in your past relationship. And you not letting it go. So, uh, you know. Mmm. Some people just don't know how to let go. The person who you was with let go. They let go a long time ago. They ain't stunting you. But you still holding on. They done moved on. You still holding on. Mm -mm 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 -mm. You need to know that you deserve love. Period. You need to know that you deserve love. So what you gonna do? Hold on to the past? Hold on to, the, to that person or that situation to where you just not happy? What? Know that you deserve love. Know that. You gotta got you gotta start speaking up about it too. Start saying full positive um intentions and get the love that you deserve as well. Okay? Um also it's time for you to start, you know, woo, getting it together. Get it together. Get it together. Some of you also need to know that there's going to be like some new relationships getting ready to happen also. Um, there's somebody that's new that had done started stirring up feelings. Okay, so don't be aware, don't be alarmed. But when you start seeing somebody really watching you, looking at you, smiling, you know, this is somebody that had done started like checking you out. Okay, and somebody is being watched from a distance. All right, so know that yes. Yes, you got to start knowing that you deserve love, okay? Because it's getting to the point now to where you just feel like you was all alone. You wanted to be by yourself because of this whole situation. But you need to know that you deserve love. And I do see you guys getting like new relationships as well. Because somebody had already started setting forth some feelings for you also. So listen, take nothing but positivity with you. Nothing but positivity. You don't want to take around nothing negative. Oh my gosh, my last person was this. My last person was that. Live in the moment. Live in the now. Now. It's the time for you to start being happy. Now it's the time for you to start receiving love. Don't you think? Tell me what you think about this. Tell me, do you think you deserve love? Because you do deserve love. But you're still stuck on the past. You stuck with the past and this person has done moved on as well. It's time for you to start making things happen with love. Make things happen with love. Okay? Keep God first as well. And make things happen. Alright? It's time for you to start letting joy and love into your heart. Into your heart and into your life. So that when you are in this new relationship, when you start knowing who this person is that has started liking you, you will have enough love and joy inside of you to be like, okay, my name is, no, I'm single. Um, can I have your number? You know. So, yeah, start making things happen with love, okay? You guys, and that is for you, those of you. 
this is a love reading for the collective people so it might be for you and it might not be for you but know that you deserve love okay you really do know that god loves you the creator of heaven and earth jesus loves you and i love you too what boo what you thought i didn't i do love you be blessed